Hi, this is a walkthrough for sending, signing, and completing a DocuSign envelope within Salesforce using Loop. To get to this point, you must have already authorized DocuSign with Loop, added a delivery option with recipients, added secure fields to your recipients if necessary, tagged up your documents with DocuSign and Loop fields, and made any connect settings. Once you are ready, you can navigate to our record on your DDP object, and then select the Loop Plus button. In our example, the opportunity stage should update to close and attach the signed contract to the notes and attachment section. In addition, it should update the related account with whatever information is input into the billing section of our document using the secure fields we set up. Now we're going to select Loop Plus, choose our contact which will auto-populate the first recipient, and run. This will then merge any data from our objects into our document and prepare it to be sent to DocuSign. We should be provided with a link for which we can preview our PDF before we send. Once the document is downloaded, we can open it up and review it. If we're satisfied with the document, we can close it out and push the Send to DocuSign button. Once this process is completed, you'll be prompted that the envelope was sent to DocuSign and be provided with an envelope ID. At that point, the first recipient will receive an email with the document to sign. They must select the Review Document link, agree to terms, and choose to review the document. Now this recipient is going to sign and complete any secure fields. The first field is the parent field to all the billing information. They can choose credit card or ACH. Because we selected to default the ACH fields with the account tags, they've been defaulted. However, the credit card information has not been defaulted with any information. We can now choose the card type, enter in a card number, a CVC number, and the expiration date. And in addition, we can sign the contract. We can select Confirm Signing to finish out the first recipient's part of the DocuSign envelope, at which point they will be prompted that it's completed and the envelope will then send to the second recipient. The second recipient will get the envelope in their inbox, in which they can open up, see the email message, and select Review Documents. They can select I Agree, Review Document, and then view any information that was merged in or filled in by the first recipient. If they want to approve the document, they can select Sign Here, Adopt Signature, and Confirm the Signature. This will complete their part of the DocuSign envelope. And because they are the last recipient, complete the envelope as a whole. Now because the DocuSign contract has been signed and completed, both recipients will get a confirmation email with the PDF attached. They can download the PDF and view it. Both signatures are on the completed contract. Now, because the contract has been completed, Salesforce should have been updated. Now we can navigate to Salesforce, refresh the opportunity record, and see that the stage was in fact changed to close and that there is a new attachment in the notes and attachment section. This is the signed and completed contract. In addition, we can go to the related account and see that the card information as well as the payment method was updated from the secure fields that the first recipients filled in. And that is how you send, sign, and complete a DocuSign envelope in Salesforce using Loop. Thank you.